हेलो एवरी वन टूडे विल स्टार्ट द नेक्स्ट लेक्चर ऑफ द चैप्टर फोर एंड द टॉपिक इज सेम द इन दस वैली सिविलाइजेशन वी विल गो अहेड इन द इन दस वैली सिविलाइजेशन सो इन प्रीवियस लेक्चर वी हैव सीन सम ऑफ द फीचर्स ऑफ द इन दस वैली सिविलाइजेशन एंड टूडे वी विल सी ऑल्सो सम टॉपिक्स लाइक ट्रांसपोर्ट In Indus Valley civilization, according to evidences that had found, some of the wheel cart had found that suggested that they were used for transport the things. The wheel cart were drawn by cattle, and they were used to transport people as well as things. And some of uh, the evidences, uh, it's clear that boats and ships are also used during that time. Now we will see that trade. The Indus Valley civilization also involved in trading system because some of the evidences shows that that they were involved in trading. Some of the precious stones like lapis lazuli were not uh, easily found in the Indus Valley civilization. That's why they uh, bought it from other civilization like uh, Afghanistan and Central Asia. So and uh, some of other things like tin. and silver from other civilization it indicate that they were they have a trading system with other civilization some of the harappan seals also found in mesopotamia that's indicate that the in the in the harappan civilization traded uh, trade um, had the trading system with the mesopotamian civilization there is a trading relation between mesopotamia and harappan civilization next is specialization of job you know that different people is expert in different type of thing so at the time so at the time some of the people were expert in doing some other things some were expert in making pots some were expert in making jewelry making steel and agriculture so that is their special special job and they only do focused on that job and they survive from this job and they work it for uh, they only work their special job now we will see the religion the in in this according to some evidences uh the archaeologists feel that there is the kind of a religious also some of uh, the uh, what asil um, has found with the image of a powerful looking man who weird headdress with two horns that's maybe according to archaeologists that's maybe their god and some of the uh, terracotta statue also found a female figure and archaeologists name them a uh, name that statue is mother goddesses so they might have been their uh, god and goddesses now we will see the administration of the indus valley civilization because we know that the indus valley civilization is settled and well planned so there must have been some leaders and rulers who made some rules and laws for the people that's why the uh, the indus valley civilization run smoothly now we will see some of the sites of the indus valley civilization from where we got some information and evidences that give us information regarding the indus valley civilization that is so we will start from mohal jodaro it is a very important sites of the indus valley civilization and it's excavated by rd banerji in 1922 and it is uh first early located in the larkana district of pakistan but now it is called the sin and it is in pakistan some of the evidences had found from uh in uh, mohan jodaro like great bath the granary the dancing girl and the prize king so one by one we will see the brief explanation about these things that what they are the great bath is just like a swimming pool it the great bath uh, made from it was the rectangular structure rectangular pool with steps leading down 
द ग्रेट बाथ इज अबाउट इलेवन पॉइंट एट एट मीटर द लेंथ ऑफ द ग्रेट बाथ वॉज इलेवन पॉइंट एट एट मीटर द ब्रेथ ऑफ द ग्रेट बाथ वॉज टू सेवन पॉइंट जीरो वन मीटर एंड द डेप्थ वॉज टू पॉइंट फोर थ्री मीटर द ग्रेट बाथ वॉज सराउंडेड बाय वॉल एंड द रूम मेड अराउंड द ग्रेट बाथ देयर इज सम अरेंजमेंट टू सेंड वाटर इन टू ग्रेट बाथ सो एंड यूजली द ग्रेट बाथ मेड इन द सिटेडल एरिया डैट आई हैव टोल यू इन द प्रीवियस चैप्टर अबाउट द सिटेडल डैट वॉज द डैट वॉज द बिल्डिंग डैट लोकेटेड इन द हायर लेवल Now we will see the great granary or hall. The great gr uh, granary was the large structure of brick, and uh, according to evidences, archaeologists says that uh, they may have been the uh, great hall for uh, storing the for uh, they were using for storing the grain, and uh, uh, be because of lack of evidences, they also said that they may have been. for the uh, uh, use uh, they have uh, they may have been used for uh, public gathering or public meeting in uh, in the in this hall and most uh, of the granary also had found in the harappa also now we will see the dancing girl statue it was the uh, bronze bronze statue and uh, this statue uh, in this statue a girl only wear bangles in her head and necklace uh, and uh, she uh, she uh, she supposed to be in a uh, posture like she put her hand uh, she kept her hand in uh, on, on her hip and uh, she sees uh, legs were one leg were kept in front so it's just looking like she supposed to start dance so we can say that they entertain themselves from dancing also one of the statue of uh, prize king had also fr uh, found from mohanjo daro the statue uh, the uh, uh, the statue of uh, of a man uh, bear bear shaped man with a half closed eye also found an archaeologist named this statue the prized king they says uh, this uh, they says that uh, they might have been a important person in the mohan jodaro so uh, we have seen some of uh, the evidences that had found from mohan jodaro and we get most of the uh, information regarding the indus valley civilization from this site so if you will face any type of problem in this uh, Uh, topics you can contact me in between 2 pm to 4 pm thank you